Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into Azus's latest networking powerhouse, the RTBE88U Wi-Fi 7 router, paired with the RPBE58BE3600AI mesh extender. This dynamic duo is built to deliver ultimate performance, eliminate dead zones, and provide seamless whole home coverage. In our hyper-connected world, few things are more frustrating than sluggish Wi-Fi that lags behind your streaming, gaming, and smart home needs, like endless buffering on your favorite 4K shows or mid-battle lag spikes. That's where the ASUS RTBE88U shines, a dual-band Wi-Fi 7 router offering speeds up to 7,200 megabits per second to future-proof your network. Together with the extender, they bring blazing fast connectivity, top-tier security, effortless setup, and family-friendly features like advanced parental controls, creating the ideal setup for reliable Wi-Fi that keeps everyone connected and safe. In this video, I'll guide you through the full setup process using just your phone. Let's get started. The ASUS RTBE88U is packed with cutting-edge technology, supporting Wi-Fi 7 standards for up to 7200 megabits per second throughput, 1376 megabits per second on the 2.4 gigahertz band and 5764 megabits per second on the 5 gigahertz band, thanks to multi-link operation that combines bands for reduced latency and congestion. It features 4096 QAM, for up to 20% faster data transmission compared to Wi-Fi 6, along with OFDMA, universal beamforming, and bandwidth options up to 160 MHz for optimal performance in 8K streaming, gaming, and multi-device households. Powered by a quad-core 2.6 GHz processor with 2 GB of RAM and 256 MB flash memory, it handles heavy loads effortlessly, while four external antennas ensure strong signal strength. Connectivity options are massive, including dual 10 gigabit ports, one RJ45 WAN LAN, and one SFP+, a 2.5 gigabits per second WAN LAN port, three additional 2.5 gigabits per second LAN ports, four gigabit LAN ports, and a USB 3.2 Gen 1 port for 3G, 4G, 5G modem tethering or file sharing, delivering up to 34 gigabits per second wired capacity. Security is top tier with AI Protection Pro, offering router assessments, malicious site blocking, two-way IPS, and infected device prevention, all backed by WPA3 encryption and features like DNS over TLS and SSH. Oh hey, please check out the affiliate links in the description. They help keep our channel alive. I really appreciate it. Getting started is incredibly simple using the Asus Router mobile app, available for iOS and Android. Just download the app, power on the router, and connect your device to its default Wi-Fi network. The app guides you through a quick three-step process to set your network name and password, configure your internet connection type, and enable custom features such as guest networks or dual WAN. In just minutes, your router is up and running, with remote management capabilities that let you monitor traffic, apply updates, or tweak settings from anywhere. As a reminder before starting, don't forget to connect the network cable. With the phone app installed, click Setup. Enable the necessary permissions on your phone for the app to run. The app will detect the default Wi-Fi. Click Connect. The app will automatically detect your model. Alternatively, you can scan the barcode on the back of the router. Click Set up a whole new network. Click Get Started. The app will automatically detect your network connection. Give your Wi-Fi network a name and a secure password to connect. Now enter an admin username and password. This is the account you'll use to manage the router from the phone app. Now you just wait while the app finishes setting things up. The router will restart at least once. Now it's time to connect your computer to the new Wi-Fi network. The app will continue setting things up and optimizing the configuration. Finally, the app will finish and bring to the dashboard. The router is now online. Before we continue, be sure to enable notifications on your phone, 
as they deliver real-time alerts for new device connections to detect intruders, security threats like infected devices or vulnerabilities from AI Protection Pro, parental control violations such as blocked content access or screen time limits, firmware updates to counter emerging risks, and network status changes like WAN failover or performance dips, transforming passive management into proactive oversight for a secure, efficient home network. Now let's talk about this router's parental controls. Protecting your family online is effortless using the built-in subscription-free parental controls integrated into AI Protection Pro. Create customized profiles to block inappropriate websites and apps. Set time schedules for internet access to encourage balanced screen time and apply safe browsing to shield against harmful content. You can tailor rules with options like customized schedules and content filtering for different age groups, ensuring kids stay safe without needing to manage each device individually. Monitor activity through real-time alerts for suspicious behavior, traffic analysis with daily, weekly, or monthly reports, and website history tracking. All manageable via the phone app and web admin site for complete peace of mind in a secure, family-friendly network. So in a quick example, Let's turn off all internet access for this child's profile. Just click block and boom, all devices in this profile are blocked. When you're ready to re-enable, just click unblock and they're back online. Blocking specific website URLs turned out to be more confusing than expected. Here are two key points to remember. First, you have to use the web admin interface, not the mobile app, to add URLs to the block list. Second, URL blocking only takes effect when devices are assigned to a family profile. Even if URLs appear in the filter settings, they won't actually be blocked unless this step is completed. Next, I set up the BE58AI mesh extender, which turned out to be surprisingly straightforward. This was a significant upgrade from my previous setup with the TP-Link RE500X. Before switching, I ran a speed test with the old TP-Link extender. While the RE500X is an excellent Wi-Fi extender, it's incompatible with Asus iMesh technology. This meant I constantly had to manually switch between the upstairs and downstairs networks when moving between my office and other areas of the house. And more importantly, it doesn't support Wi-Fi 7. To set up AI Mesh Extender, I first connected to the router with a network cable and then initiated the configuration on the mobile app. Within minutes, it was configured and recognized on the network. In my laptop's Wi-Fi settings, the old extender network is now gone, and the signal strength of the home network is noticeably higher. So running the speed test again using the AI mesh extender, and boom, the download speeds have doubled. I was not expecting such a big performance boost. Well, there you have it. We covered installing and configuring the ASUS RTBE88U Wi-Fi 7 router and RPBE58 Wi-Fi 7 extender. The performance improvements have been absolutely remarkable, from seamless roaming throughout the house to blazing fast Wi-Fi 7 speeds that handle everything I throw at them. If you're on the fence about upgrading to Wi-Fi 7, these two devices make a compelling case for making the jump. The installation was straightforward. The AI mesh integration works flawlessly, and the real-world performance gains are immediately noticeable. And don't forget the robust parental control features that provide peace of mind with content filtering, scheduling options, and monitoring capabilities that make managing your family's internet access both simple and effective. Thanks for watching. Oh hey, please check out the affiliate links in the description. They help keep our channel alive. I really appreciate it. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss our next tech review. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.